Hey guys, it's Tony with Backwoods Biker Magazine again. I have got the folder of the month for August. Hang tight, check it out. All right guys, welcome back. Uh, you know, <clears throat> since we started doing this folder thing this year, uh, we've had a lot of knives submitted to us. Um, most of them have not made it onto the channel or, or into the magazine because to be quite frank, I just didn't think that it was anything that I would ever want to recommend um, to anybody. You know, I'm just being frank. So if you send a knife and we didn't put it out there for you, uh, you should have asked before. I mean, I don't want to be mean about it, but that's just the truth. We get too much crap sent to us, you know, and I'm not going to show it to anybody. But what I have in my hand right here is one of the most interesting and <laughs> it is a little bit puzzling too when you look at it uh, and it took us a while to, to figure this out on how to deploy this knife but this is from Mantis Knives and it is the 2021 uh, DP that stands for drop point um, and I will get up close up for this to you let you see this up close and personal because this knife it reminds me of something steampunk which i think is cool uh, and i'll tell you right out of the gate here that this is not a knife that i would carry out in the bush because i see a lot of uh, failure bush failure with this knife and when it's up close you're going to see it but if all you're going to do is carry a knife around your pocket you know uh, working around you know the barn or the house or carry it in your pocket for work uh, that'd be fine I think it'd be alright for that but if it was me and I'm not a knife collector if I have a knife I'm using the, the doggy out of that thing uh, but if you're a knife collector this is a knife that you might really want to serious seriously consider so hang tight we're gonna get the camera set up for some close-up shots so you can see this up close and personal alright there you go that is the close-up of the Mantis 2021 DPC. The DPC stands for Drop Point Copper. It's got that copper ring insert here. But why you admire that knife, let me just give you the specs on it real quick here. Uh, it's overall 8.625 inches. It has a blade length of 4 inches. And the material on the blade is 440C. Um, handle is AUS-8 material. It has a liner lock, which is very, very uh, easy to uh, put the knife back away. The belt clip on it is stout, weighs 6.3 ounces. And what is really cool, and I'll show you this, it opens using a series of gears with a simple push of the button stud, okay? So, I mean, the first thing that you're gonna see that really jumps out to you is the beauty of this copper ring right here. Uh, and it has these uh, almost uh, brushed nickel kind of dull little gears in the back and then it has this lever here that actually deploys the blade and we have seen many knives that have had you know this gimmicky type of deployment system you know supposed to be able to do it with one hand and they just didn't work but we've been flipping this thing through over and over again watch this I mean it just comes open it's butter smooth it's it's a classic man i mean i really really dig this knife it's it's super and when you when you put it back away and you see how those gears are moving all right i'm going to try to do this so you can see those gears but that, it's hard for me here in this camera shot here let me see no i'm not going to be able to do it very well yeah because i get in the way of it i'm sorry about that but yeah that is a super knife okay now, from a practical side, I'll be honest with you, this is not something that I would buy to take out in the bush with me because of the gears. They're intricate, they're cool, but I see dirt, grime, blood, sinew, fat, all kinds of things getting in the way of those gears. Um, but if I were, you know, just want a knife to carry around a barn with me or carry... Um, you know, out in the field that I'm working in uh, or take it to the shop with me 
or especially if I was a knife collector, which I'm not. I don't collect knives. I use knives that I have. Uh, and if I can't use them, I don't keep them. You know, if, if there's something that just lays around uh, on my shelf, in my shop, or in the studio, um, I don't keep them. But this would be a great knife for a collector because as you can see, it's just beautiful. Man, it's got that steampunk look right here. That's what really got me. I'm, I dig steampunk stuff. Belt clip is stout. And the lanyard, the lanyard is not a lanyard hole, but it is a lanyard slot. Can you see that? There you go. That's a better, better picture there. Very, very big. A lot of guys put uh, lanyard holes in their knives and you can't even fit paracord in it. You know, what's up with that? Uh, but there you go. That is the folder of the month for August 2019. The Mantis gearhead 2021 dpc um, you go out to their website if you want to buy this it's 266 dollars but if you will go to battle box and you will um, get their pro plus level you get this thing for 149.99 what a bargain because you get all the other gear too all right that's the close-up. Hang tight. You know, if you like this knife and you, and you want to buy the knife, you can go out on Manus's website. And this morning when I, I, I looked, it was $266. Um, and you hit the buy button, it'll take you right out to PayPal. It's 266 bucks. But the best bargain out there right now is through BattleBox. This knife was included in the Pro Plus level which cost $149.99. That's no kidding. And I tell people this all the time. If you're a knife guy, buy from BattleBox and get their Pro Plus level because in the Pro Plus level, you always get a premium knife plus all the other gear that comes in that box. You know, from the basic to the advanced to the Pro to the Pro Plus. Uh, $149 versus $266. Plus, you get all that gear from BattleBox. It's uh, www.battlebox.com. You know, they're a great company, great people, very integral, honest, great customer service. Okay? With that being said, I hope you liked the video. Hope you like this sick knife, man. The <laughs> gearhead from, from Manus Knives. It's, it's, it's really cool. Uh, if you like the videos that we're doing, hit the subscribe button. Help us out, become a subscriber. And then that email down there, all you got to do is email Tony at BackwoodsBiker.com and we'll put you in our database for our giveaways every month. And this month we're giving away two knives, uh, both of them by Gerber. Pretty cool little knives, nice little folders. It'd be uh, great for any kit uh, or if you'd want to put it in your pocket, it doesn't matter. But they're, they're great little knives. <laughs> you ride free, you live free, and as always, man, especially with these knives, you be safe out there.